Hi, welcome to the show. And we are here in Brooklyn at the uh, flea market, Brooklyn's flea market. Every weekend this takes place. But I came across something that had caught my eye earlier today, and it's about the re boundary organization. We're going to talk to the owner and some of the guys who are doing things with the owner. So um, come on in here. So tell the folks what's your name. Uh, my name is Tommy Safian. I'm the co-founder of uh, Refoundry. It's a not -for new not-for-profit and we train people coming out of prison to repurpose and uh, refurbish discarded furniture and other materials into one-of-a-kind home furnishings and then we incubate them into their own businesses. Okay, okay. So now I want to ask you the question, what inspired you to create something like this for the guys? Well, because the, there's a lot of, uh, not a lot of opportunity for people coming out of prison. There are a lot of barriers yeah. and uh, we feel that they're just wasted human resources and there's a lot of uh, ways that we can provide opportunity f okay. for this population and we want to try and do that in a way that doesn't cost a lot of government money, that's a lot more effective than other organizations are doing because they are restricted by government funds. We don't take any government funding. Okay. We hope to be self self uh, self funding within two or three years, and we work with a lot of other organizations and businesses and professionals. And so, what are some of the other organizations you work with? We work with the Fortune Society, uh, Def uh, Defy Ventures, okay. um, Brooklyn Flea, which okay. is where we're at right now. Okay. Um, uh, and uh, businesses, uh, ABC Home, Soho House. Oh yeah. Okay, let's let's talk to some of the guys who are yeah. working with you. Why don't you come on up, Charles? Hey, what's your name? Um, Charles. Charles McNick. Okay, this is this is Charles McNick. We got another guy back here in in the background on his hair. So Charles, so how do you like the program? Oh, uh, the program is great. You know, um, for me, uh, as an individual who just came home from prison not too long ago, okay. it kind of gave me direction and the focus to head down the right path, give me something to do to better myself, give me a dream to chase. Okay, so, so it helps. So you're, you're good at, at what, what you're doing here? Yeah, basically, well, you know, what we do is find this garden materials, we refurbish it, fix it, put it together, clean it with, you know, environmentally friendly materials, and we sell them. Okay, so he was saying that, um, like you guys, create your own business after this, doing yes. this program? So, that's a, that's so come on, give me, what, what's, what's, what's your vision? My vision, uh, well, basically, I want to do something like this, not exactly in a flea market setting. I think a okay. more of a storefront okay. in a great location, okay. using you know some, some of the similar materials that we have, we actually have already, okay. and um, basically doing it on a more day-to-day -day process. Where, whereas this is like only the weekend, so I want to do something that's more 24 hours, okay. five business days, five days a week. You know, I'm trying to he's trying to make him some money here. Yeah, yeah, yeah definitely. Okay, so. Um, <laughs> Any other things that you guys do here at, at the foundation or what? Oh, we got a mentoring, a mentoring program that we are part of. Um, basically, we talk to and get a, you know, a relation. We'll have a relationship with basically a lot of people who's in the business field, who's doing things different from what we're doing, but can hand down ideas. And we kind of just ping pong ideas from there over the mentorship. I want to say thanks for being on the show. And I see, I see you're, you're, you're in the card here. And then this guy over here is in the card as well. Refoundry. The Refoundry. Okay, thanks a lot. Check us out.